Brian, uh, Brian again, I'm going to try and do, I guess, another little informational, uh, couple people that, uh, so the uh, last one I did, so it kind of helped them. These were beginners, you know, so um, just another beginning thing I could think of to talk about. Um, you know, once you know how to tune your guitar, once you got three or four chords under your belt, you know, just try and try, you know, just, I guess, improvising around, you know, see what sounds good, um, see what you might be able to create on your own rather than just copy. Um, other people's licks, although, I mean, um, some people say that's not worth doing, uh, I would, I'm somewhere, I'm somewhere in the middle, I guess, I'd say, you know, try and get a feel for what people are doing, I don't, uh, subscribe to the getting it note for note for note, just in, um, you know, the only reason to be doing that is if you're playing in a cover band or something, you want to get it exactly right, but, you know, if you can kind of figure out the techniques of some people that you admire by doing that, that's cool. But, you know, it's also neat just to try and find something of your own. So, do something I don't often do in these. I'm going to try and do something off the cuff, and let's see if we can develop it. Let's see. I'm in standard tuning. And let's see. Sounds a little bit too much like some stuff I've done. Let's, let's try something with intervals. have to put that in so I gotta cut that out. There you go, that's an example. Um, I'd say that's about 80% off the cuff. And I say 80% because there's certain shapes and things I've come to, uh, you know, have some experience with, uh, you know, bits and pieces of things. Uh, knowing uh, something about scales helps too. So I kind of, you have some familiarity with your scales you might hit certain things, you know, that you've kind of come to expect, oh, okay, that will be in key, you know, so, say 20% of it is probably just stuff I built up on, uh, you know, just experience playing, but the rest of that, I was just, just experimenting, I thought some of it sounded okay, but, you know, just to give you guys an idea that uh, you might be able to work up to, um, you might be able to work up to uh, coming up with your own ideas, your own songs, just from noodling around. I guess that's more of a uh, uh, 
more of the accepted term for goofing off on your guitar and noodling, you know. We don't want to call it fiddling because we're not fiddling here, so. But anyway, I don't know if that's of any use to anybody or not, but uh, I can think of a couple people I work with that play, that are learning to play. That'd be good advice, you know. Just just open up your mind. Just sit and play and see what sounds good. So that's another thing just for the, uh, that's good for anybody, even if you're a well-trained musician, been at this for years, you can get in ruts. Believe me, I, I, I know all about the ruts. So anyway, that's my advice. Thanks. Bye.